Hey guys, Southern Seattle here. Welcome back to another Uta Macross update video. So before we begin with all the mission um, explanations, it will be slightly long depending how fast I can translate the stuff. Uh, first thing off, if you enter the game uh, when the server reset, you'll know that they actually started a new round of discounted, um, you know, singing stone sales here, you can tell. Um, this whole batch that gives the New Year's envelopes, then of course, this one has been around for a while, but it's um, the third round, which is surprising. Uh, usually there's only two rounds, but three rounds of discounted sales with the Nyan Kuji tickets. So that's a thing now. <laughs> I guess they're really trying hard um, to, to take in all our cash. Uh, so, hmm. <laughs> of course, there's this whole brand new set of uh, the regular discounted singing stone packs as well that comes with the seasonal spheres. Usually, they give more singing stones, and of course, the seasonal spheres compared to the rest of them, uh, 500 lesser and 700 lesser at the same price of 10,000 yen. So, really, if you have the singing stones, or rather, you have the physical cash for it, um, spend wisely. Buy what you need the most uh, my recommendation is still going with the Nyan Kuji tickets uh, because the Nyan Kuji actually gives you um, materials for your episode plates unlike the New Year's envelope pack because the store exchange for the New Year's envelope pack is not as loaded um, I would say it's not that appealing compared to the rest of the stuff um, so yeah, not so luxurious. Uh, so anyways, let's dive into the mission page and we'll talk about the brand new Yami Kure missions including the bingo card. So we'll start with the bingo missions first because there's three pages worth of bingo missions and from what we've been through for the past four years for the Nyan Nyan bingo missions, it should roughly be the same. So let's try and take a look. Um, I will update I think on Instagram and both the YouTube community page when page 2 and page 3 is unlocked eventually because I don't think I need to do a video to explain what they are <laughs> but it's just a yeah, coincidence that they release this according uh, along with the Yami Kuri mission so like the first one here um, player rank 8 so if you guys play this game as long as I have 4 years this will instantly clear as you can tell. Um, then we have this one, which is the um, play one time of event um, songs. So there's currently no event going on, but you know, you can use the event um, resource songs to clear this one. So that's not too difficult. Then of course, there's this one. Um, yeah, so the daily event songs, just play them three times you should be fine. Um, why not, you know, just gain those extra resources uh, to, you know, stand by for future episode plays. Um, this one. So, pull a total of gacha five times. So, and the special notification at the bottom, 10 plate pulls are considered a single pull. So, not really worthwhile to pull 10 plates at one go, but we do have a template free pool every day, so that's considered one pool. Um, then, of course, you have the three daily free pools, so that's a total of four. If you're in a hurry to clear all the gacha required pool missions right away, you could use a super dimension tickets to try and get that last gacha pool, but I don't see a need to because there's always one uh, mission that is requiring to log in a total amount of days so let's clear um, the missions accordingly so this one requires you to hit 500,000 high score on any song so as long as you have got a good decent amount of 6 star episode plays this one should be no problem uh, it doesn't even go 1 million so I think maybe even 5 star episode plays uh, will do the trick score double S rank for one time as pretty easy as well um, you know as when you're trying to get those resources from the event daily songs you should be able to clear this easily activate Cho Tahime mode and clear the song yeah that's pretty easy as well 
Um, doesn't have to be any high difficulty song, you know, as long as you activate Cho Utahime mode and clear the song. It, even on the easiest song mode, that's fine. Um, episode plate, obtain 10 pieces. That's easy! You, you've got a free template too! You, just, you pull that single gacha and you're done with this one. And here it is, the last one for the bingo missions of page 1. Login a total of two days, so there it is. So after you're done with tomorrow's uh, server reset, I could do an update regarding um, page two uh, as long as I cleared this personally for myself. Um, which shouldn't be too difficult. I'm sure some of you guys out there who don't use your entire stash of super damaging gacha tickets, this would not be a problem for you. Alright, so let's move on to the main topic of the video. It's the Yamu Kyure vi uh, missions, which comes with a pretty interesting reward. So the first three rows, as you can tell, there is no um, blue button here because it is an auto-clear mission as long as you meet the requirement, which is the last one which comes with the special display pin for your profile. Um, yeah, so basically you just need to clear a total of 45 missions, that means all these missions here clear, you know, that's that's kind of a task. <laughs> Alright, so let's break down the missions accordingly in batches, according to what they have. So as you can tell from the very hard, um, we just count from, yeah, the, total, the highest number. So play any song out there with a very hard difficulty and higher. So basically, if you can clear extreme, clear extreme, it will still clear this. So for those of you who have been struggling with music games and can only clear like difficulties below very hard, that means from easy, normal, and hard, um, you might have a problem with this set of missions because the missions require to tackle very hard and extreme. As you can tell from the next set, it says here, um, which is the same thing, so um, basically get clear the any song out there with a score rank of double S 50 times. Um, this one shouldn't be a problem. I don't think you can use skip tickets for this if I'm not wrong because double S rank scores. Maybe, maybe skip tickets can be used. I don't know. If, if I end up using skip tickets and it clears, I will write it in the comment section of this video. <laughs> Um, so yeah, as you can see here, it's the same stuff, double S rank, whoa, but apparently this one needs you to clear 100 times for extreme. So yeah, if you guys can handle extreme, especially for those very easy extreme songs that has like a difficulty of um, 21, 22, um, you shouldn't have a problem with this one. Um, so yeah, man, it gives you guys a chance who have only been tackling very hard and afraid to move into the extreme territory, it's time to practice your extreme skills, get good, you know, and hopefully clear all these missions. Alright, so extreme requires you to clear a total of 100 times, so if you, if you just go straight to extreme, you should clear the very hard missions instantly. And the next set here, oh boy, they require you to do full combo. So they do include the difficulty hard here, but of course as you can tell, um, very hard is next, then there's extreme. So apparently the full combo missions, uh, they, you can use any song. So um, the full combo missions go under the very hard and above. So just tackle very hard if you can only do very hard. So then apparently the extreme missions here require the song Glow in the Dark. So I assume Glow in the Dark is now a permanent song. I've yet to see the live tab, so we'll check it out later. So, so extreme um, difficulty score rank of double S, 10 times clear. That's not too difficult. Um, then there's the full combo, which is a 5 times clear. So that might be a problem because when the event was going on for Glow in the Dark, um, I did get a full combo for the song, but you know, it was on those days that my focus was really, really good. So, yeah, this might be a bit difficult. But luckily enough, it's only requesting five full combo clears of Glow in the Dark. 
So, whew. then of course, followed by this one. Oh boy, here comes the high score challenges. Oh my goodness, this is not easy. Okay, okay, so, okay. The highest score they're asking for right here is a 9 million score for any song. Oh my goodness. 9 million! Have I ever gotten anything higher than 7 or 8 million? Oh no. <laughs> this is going to be one interesting challenge, but it's nice. It's nice to have such a mission because you get to interact with people, especially for myself. Um, I have Japanese friends on the Twitter site and the last time we had to go through missions like this, um, of course, tips from every player out there who's playing Utah Macross, especially for those hardcore ones um, that don't really use um, plus 25 luck episode plates, you know, the, the ones that play casually. Um, so they'll give you tips and tricks, like maybe having three copies of episode plates that improve the um, long or short skill uh, episode plates out there, so that kind of stuff. So if you guys want to figure out how to gain good high score episode plates, I think there is a tutorial video that I did. You can go check it out in my tutorial playlist. Alright, moving along. So these are the ones that regarding the color of the song. So we have the Soul series. So apparently the Soul series is requesting 5 million high score. And the Star series is also asking for 5 million for the highest quantity. And of course the Love series. So apparently the rainbow sets are not included so that's pretty much it for the yummy kure missions so it is going to be a bit of a challenge especially for that 9 million high score for any song this is ridiculous but you know for um, 10 pieces of the rare up star fragments no no luck stone luck stone fragments sorry <laughs> i think it's a pretty decent reward but still um so with all the missions here let's see how many missions are there in this whole thing one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six twenty seven twenty eight twenty nine thirty thirty one thirty two thirty three 34, 35. 35? Oh. Wait, what? Are they gonna release daily missions for this? Because 35 missions out of 45 required? That's not enough. So I assume, I'm, I'm assuming here that the regular missions are just here, but once the Red Boss event begins, they might introduce daily missions so with the daily missions included since the first day is today which is the 16th of january up to the 30th of january so 14 days um that's not too bad 14 days if the since the raid boss event starts on the 17th so that technically it's just one day late so it's 13 days worth of um daily missions i think that should easily cover you the 45 missions uh, required. Nah, that's not too bad, not too bad. Okay, uh, considering that maybe they have like each day there's two missions or three missions on dailies, it'll be easily cleared and you'll be able to get this wonderful Yami Kure pin for your profile in the future. So guys, work hard um, at all these missions. Let's, let's take a look at the live tab. I think I think Glow in Your Dark has been finally added to a permanent status. No? Where is it? Oh! Oh! Is, is Glow in the Dark going to be one of the repeated events songs? Maybe? I guess the Red Boss event might include it as one of the song selections that you can do. So anyways guys, um, last 20 hours for the current event, uh, hopefully you guys have been busy and claim all the rewards. Um, you know, hopefully you guys are doing that because that's pretty much what you should be doing. I've already cleared all my basic rewards and I've already gotten my special badge from this list of Kuji rewards as well. Um, 
So yeah, you should technically be working hard at it and I guess since it's a tutorial video and I'm yet to do my daily poo so why not guys, let's have a bit of an enjoyment at the end here so I can prove my point that you know the sing a single template poo is still defined as a single poo. So let's do this, let's check out today's luck. So in the last 3 days actually for this template free pool, I got pretty lucky, no 7 star episode plates at least, but you know, yeah, I did get some decent um, 5 star episode plates uh, that are new and of course evolving some older plates as well, especially this pretty awesome Minmei plate um, that comes with a skill improvement ability, so this pool is a bummer, so <laughs> I'm just gonna skip everything because not a single red box, not a single rainbow, no Valkyrie animations, nothing. So it's a dry spell after all the pretty good decent luck. So I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys the Min Mei plate that I'm talking about. I think this is definitely one of the best Min Mei plates out there. Um at this point in time, so let me see, here we go. I've already curified Min Mei's episode plate because it's so awesome. So yeah, and you know, 3,683 total score, well balanced stats all around, and of course, because it's at this plus luck, plus 5 luck value, um, the total score is generally boosted by a bit because of the luck notes. So, yeah, anyways, when you use this episode plate for Star Series Song, units total is boosted by 35% up. That is if you use this episode plate as a center position. Um, then, of course, there's the uh, healing. 50% recovery. So I'm using this episode plate as my healing center active plate right now for the current event. Um, you know, because it would be nice to gain that 120% boost bonus or uh, with the 80% love your life remaining. You know, so and then of course the main thing here which is the short duration score ability improvement life skill plus this episode plate comes with a special score note attached to it. So that's one of the main reasons why I had to curify this episode plate and I was very happy when I actually pulled this plate out from the free template pool. So awesome, awesome stuff. So guys, if you guys have this episode plate, make sure you guys power it up. It is definitely worth your resources. Um, even if you are not a Mimei fan, but you know, I'm a Maki Rei fan, so this episode play is definitely up my alley in terms of usefulness. Plus, since now we are aiming for that 9 million high score mission, oh god. Guys, let's do our best, let's struggle together. Of course, if I do eventually hit that 9 million high score, I will show you my setup. And hopefully you guys were able to try and duplicate uh, mimic or maybe alter a bit because you don't own some of the episode plates that I have that kind of stuff So all the best guys to the mission clearing and hopefully you guys get some nice pools from the free template pools as well and Yeah, so until then I'll see you guys soon. Well, technically uh, Tomorrow I suppose since 17th of January is when the Red Boss event starts and that's a brand new gacha day, so a new gacha video has to come out, <laughs> right? Bye!